Back like we never left. What is good, everybody? Today's video was inspired by a recent coaching session where we discussed the importance of silence and your absence during no contact. Even when your ex is already in that new rebound relationship. Now you already know how I get down. I don't like to waste time and I'm ready to get into it. So let's do that right now. It's a lonely and a sad ass feeling when someone you care about becomes a stranger. And likely you're probably bothered right now. It ain't that the relationship ended, that y'all couldn't work out your issues, or even that the changes made y'all so distant while still trying to figure things out. It's the fact that your ex moved on to a new rebound relationship immediately after your breakup. And define fast. Days, weeks, it don't matter. It could have been the day of or even before the breakup. You truly don't know shit. Because once it ends, the only thing you think about is that maybe, just maybe, the breakup will only be temporary. There is always that hope that that love the two of you share is strong enough to bring you back together to work on the relationship and to go back to the way things used to be. But that's not how it worked out for you. And now that your ex has moved on, you find disrespected now. Like you don't even take time to heal? Yet they wiped you off their social media and now they're flaunting the new man or woman they were likely seeing during your relationship? But see, this is the important part of going no contact. See, your absence in someone's life reveals a few different things. The first is if the void you left truly mattered to them. If the emotional support you provided, the love that you gave, the time that you spent together, the sacrifices you made during the relationship actually meant anything to your ex. Then that absence is a void that can't be filled by another man or woman. Because you know what matters in this life is having people in your life that ride for you, that go to war for you, that show the empathy and compassion we all say that we want. And when you find that, it's just not that easy to go straight into a new rebound relationship. And even if you do, can't nobody, and I mean nobody, replace you. And that type of self-belief is necessary during no contact. Ultimately, your silence serves as the biggest testament you can have to your ex after that breakup. And no matter how much they flaunt that new relationship, no matter how bad you want to send that long ass page text or email that you've already typed up, no matter how frustrated you are, disappointed, hurt, no matter how many sleepless nights you've had, your absence from their life and the silence you possess during no contact affords you two opportunities. The first is that if you used to be needy for attention during the relationship, insecure, constantly texting, that you're changed. The second is the most important, and that is that you get to see just how loved, appreciated, and overall how much you meant to your ex because they'll either realize how much you truly meant and reach back out to you or you'll start understanding your value, your self-worth and regaining your confidence and not even wanting to go back to what broke you in the first place. As always, thank you to every single one of you for tuning in and checking out this video today. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and that bell notification down bottom and join a team that will always push you towards personal greatness. I'll be back soon with another new video, but in the meantime, have an amazing day. Stay strong and stay inspired. And as always, until I see you guys next time, peace.